My name is Julia Rother, and I was the senior developer for the Balestra Fencing Shoe. All of the athletes that we've worked with have been very surprised that Nike is taking an interest in their sport. Yeah, there's three big things for fencers that are, that are major problems and obstacles for them. So the footwork itself is very, very dynamic. Um, they're always, they're up on their toes, they have these huge dramatic lunges, they're smacking their foot, their heel when they're lunging at about five to six times their body weight, and then they drag their trail leg behind them. So you've got all this abrasion that's happening on the trail leg. The surface is kind of a metal grate. It, it resembles a cheese grater. It's very sharp. And so because of that, because of this um, very um, sharp surface, we really needed to keep in mind the durability of the shoe. So you've got uh, zoom air and pour on in the heel. So when they're making these huge lunges forward, you've got enough protection. And normally the cushioning for a running shoe would be kind of straight up and down underneath the shoe. We actually have more cushioning coming off the shoe, so you get a slight bubble wrapped around here. You've got lots of rubber and it's radius depending on which angle you come in at when you're lunging. On the trailing foot, the, they're dragging the foot. As they plant the front foot, they're dragging the, the medial side. and It's pretty amazing how far over they get. We recess the laces here for durability and they actually, we have seen some wear this far up on the shoe. So they're actually pulling their foot almost completely sideways and dragging it across this metal surface. And then the synthetic itself is, a normal synthetic would be in a stole abrasion machine it would last about a thousand cycles and then it would kind of give out. This lasts 15,000 cycles. And we've never had an athlete who's actually penetrated this surface yet. Seeing the faces of the athletes light up when they realize that you, you did what they asked you to and, and that, that you were sincere in really wanting to make a shoe for them that's going to improve their performance. You know, it's not about, you know, what color do you like or, you know, to put some, you know, a little gold here and gold there. It's about, you know, really, really creating a product that's going to help them um, achieve their goals.